Dear participants of the conference, ladies and gentlemen, uh, first of all, uh, let me express my uh, sincere gratitude for this uh, wonderful organization of this symposium and inviting me to speak today on a very interesting subject, um, cultural diplomacy in Central Asia and Caucasus. I want to stress uh, that Eurasian uh, Economic Union uh, is not a political union. The nature of uh, our union is uh, purely uh, economic. In uh, 2016, President of Kazakhstan, Nursultan Nazarbayev, is, uh, being the chairman of uh, Supreme of Eurasian Economic Council, offered to expand uh, economic relations um, between with the uh, third countries and the integration unions. Give, uh, an uh, opportunity to form to form a uh, common uh, area with uh, no barriers for goods on the Eurasian continent. Uh, we see growing opportunities for trade and economic cooperation between the countries of uh, European Union and Eurasian Economic Union. The Union accepted a policy of alignment uh, with the economic belt of the Silk Road. Besides, we hope uh, to find a common uh, ground with the uh, European Union and Shanghai Cooperation Organization. What is the uh, Eurasian Economic Union today? Uh, uh, it is a single market uh, with uh, 182 million people and foreign trade uh, turnover of the one, tri one trillion uh, uh, US dollars, where the um, uh, European un Union's uh, shares is more than 22 percentage is around uh, 22 billion of uh, US dollars. While the trade to Nova between Kazakhstan and uh, the European, European Union exceeds uh, uh, 20 we, uh, 21 billion US dollars and counted uh, for almost uh, 40 percentage. I would like to hi highlight uh, that the German and Kazakhstan have a very profound bilateral trade and economic partnership. Kazakhstan share is more than uh, 85 uh, percentage from Central Asia countries in the Germany to total trade turnover. Our country is uh, among five uh, main raw mat materials supplier uh, for Germany and plays uh, an important role in energy, energy security of Germany and itself and the European as a whole. Uh, the investment uh, from uh, European countries to Kazakhstan are uh, considerable um, for the last uh, 11 years, almost 50 uh, percentage of uh, FDIs to Kazakhstan were from uh, uh, European Union countries. Uh, while Germany interested in our economy almost uh, 4 billion US uh, dollars, which is almost uh, 4 percentage uh, total European Union investment to in Kazakhstan. Kazakhstan is interested uh, in further uh, development of partnership with the European Union as a whole uh, and German in particular. We already have a very successful practice of beautiful uh, cooperation in such areas as machinery, subsoil use, um, oil processing, energy efficiency, uh, development of uh, transport and logistic infrastructure, uh, pharmaceuticals, um, technologies and uh, let me specify that 90% uh, of uh, Germany FDIs uh, are non-oil sector. We are actively increase uh, our cooperation is uh, in adapting uh, Germany uh, expertise in energy saving and energy efficiency. Now we are implement a uh, project under um, the agreement on cooperation in raw industrial and technology spheres. Therefore, uh, we already have a good platform for further increase in economic uh, interaction. European countries uh, can establish uh, plants, factories, uh, processing companies within the Eurasian Economic Union and import uh, products of processed raw materials with higher added value. It will be win-win. Uh, this approach will ac ac accelerate industrialization uh, process in our countries and uh, contribute to the economy diversification. While the European Union will make uh, fruitful uh, investments, expand business uh, benefit from cost saving, 
which will be make uh, European final product more competitive. We already have success stories in, of Germany, companies working in Kazakhstan, uh, Heidelberg Cement uh, has three cement factories in Kazakhstan that cover the one third uh, of the local market and export uh, cement uh, to Russia, Uzbekistan, Turkmenistan and Azerbaijan. Uh, this year, the, the, the company plans to buy out the full cement plant. Now, Funke and Henkel produce building materials, Linde, industrial gases. Baumer uh, produces uh, ball valves. Isaplus produces um, pipes and tubes. We also have uh, retail stores of Metro Cash and Carry. This year, uh, our head of uh, state, uh, Nur Sultan Arzabayev, announced Kazakhstan's modernization 3.0. Today, uh, new technologies enable uh, all the developing countries to leapfrog the, the gap and ensure fast economic development and sustainable growth. The developed world uh, in its turn uh, shares uh, expertise and acknowledge um, much uh, needed by the developing countries. Germany is a credible uh, in the industry 4.0. We highly Eastern uh, science and high expertise of Germany and therefore closely uh, interact with the uh, Fraunhofer Institute. Uh, I hope that as a result of this uh, partnership, we will be able to adapt elements of industry point uh, 4.0. Uh, introduce manufacturing uh, di digitalization and develop a package of systematic and uh, industry specified measures as well as the uh, incentives. Uh, which areas um, we can to focus on further cooperation through the lens of the modernization 3.0. We can to make a good offer to German automobile companies. Uh, they can to produce uh, assemble cars and uh, vehicles uh, in Kazakhstan with uh, graduate um, production localization. We're interested in uh, high expertise technologies, innovations, as well as good practice of supplier development program that we enforce development of our uh, small and medium enterprises. Uh, besides high interest and uh, big opportunities uh, in the following sectors, export-oriented uh, high-tech manuf manufacturing, IT, mining and metallurgy, agri-industry. I'm sure that we will, uh, with new technologies, new business the models, will uh, engine growth and cross-region cooperation. Another area of huge prospects and opportunities in transport and uh, transit development. As you might be ever, uh, Kazakhstan is located in the center of the Eurasian continent at the crossroads of many transport corridors. Kazakhstan contributes to uh, development of transport and logistic infrastructure between Asia and Europe. We have already established uh, transport corridors uh, from east to west and uh, from north to south. New roads uh, have emerged uh, through Kazakhstan, through China to Russia and Europe through Caspian Sea to Caucasus and Turkey. They reduce uh, the delivery time twice in comparison uh, to the uh, traditional sea roads. Uh, today we, are we revive uh, the new silkway creating the main automobile transport corridor Western Europe and uh, Western China. Delivery of goods using uh, this transport corridor will take around 10 days. In uh, comparison uh, to sea road of 45 days. Transit is a 14 days. Uh, we expect uh, that uh, by 2020, 8% of uh, goods turnover between China and European Union will go through the, this transport corridor and it is around 50 billion US dollars. For the last five years, uh, container traffic China, Europe, China uh, increased uh, in uh, 40 times. Uh, the distance between China and Europe uh, decreased uh, by 1.200 uh, kilometers. 
we have uh, access to the countries of the Gulf and uh, Middle East. These numbers speak uh, by themselves, and I, I invite European companies to use these uh, new opportunities. I want to stress that uh, Kazakhstan, uh, Kazakhstan's economy uh, has become more attractive for foreign capital. In 2014, we have attractive, attracted uh, four percentage uh, more uh, foreign um, uh, investment uh, than in 2015. It is more than 20 billion uh, investment came into the economy. The government works uh, on providing the best investment climate. Uh, in, the, in this respect, Kazakhstan is uh, dedicated to the uh, highest uh, standards of uh, OECD. This February, uh, the OECD Council decided to invite Kazakhstan to join the OECD Investment Committee. And we see it is as a sign of trust and indicator uh, coherence uh, of the Kazakhstan investment climate uh, to the world standards. <coughs> what we have to offer? Uh, first of all, uh, for uh, favorable uh, condition of business and investment climate. We have reduced uh, and simplified permit system. Uh, besides the Ministry of uh, for Investment and Development uh, service as one-stop shop for investors. We will uh, help and support in any instance uh, the investor might uh, think of. All the reforms uh, within the last five years enable Kazakhstan to uh, attain uh, 50 36 position uh, in the World Bank rating, uh, ra rating uh, doing business, and we will continue this work. Secondly, uh, today citizens is uh, more 60 countries enjoy visa-free regime. Uh, all OECD countries uh, are, uh, are on the list. Third, uh, we are actively working uh, on the appropri appropriate infrastructure development. For investors, uh, there are um, uh, ten special economic zones uh, where an investor can set up production uh, facilities on a plug-play uh, basis. Besides, uh, there are special uh, incentive package, uh, including in side grains, tax, and custom benefits, and cashback on capital investment. For uh, Kazakhstan is working uh, on capital market development. Uh, we are launch uh, the International Financial Center Astana. Uh, I would like to emphasize that uh, the financial center will be regulated based on the standards of the world leading financial centers, as well as uh, principle uh, and rules on the English common law. Uh, English uh, will act as uh, working language and for both correspondence and legal proceedings. Also in Astana, there will be creating, uh, created the International uh, Arbitrage uh, Center, uh, AFC, FC, uh, based on the experience of Dubai. In this aspect, uh, Kazakhstan as, uh, is a pioneer uh, among all the CIS and Central Asia countries. Fix, uh, we have uh, launched a new privatization program that uh, stipulates, stimulates some uh, transfer of almost uh, 800 state-owned enterprises. Many of these companies will be privatized uh, through the uh, Astana Financial Center. Six, uh, as I mentioned before, Kazakhstan is um, uh, at the crossroads besides the Eurasian Union's market. A huge neighboring market of China is uh, accessible uh, through well-established uh, transport and logistic infrastructure. Kazakhstan has uh, positioned itself as business, transit, and logistic hub of Central Asia and broad uh, bridge between Europe and, uh, and Asia. The gateway uh, to this market of this Eurasian Economic Union. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I'm more than happy to invite you to visit Kazakhstan one day, see our beautiful growing country with your 
own eyes and make a fruitful uh, decision to uh, to work in Kazakhstan. Thank you very much.